Okay, um, good afternoon. So today, I'm going to assist you guys in solving question number 8, right? So, the question says that ABC is a triangle. P is any point on BC. So, P is a point on the line BC. PQ is the resultant of AP, PB, and PC. Show that ABQC is a parallelogram. And Q is therefore a fixed point, right? That's the question. So, first of all, you're going to draw your triangle then you show p on bc right then trying to figure out you try to figure out where q is or where q lies either on the triangle or outside the triangle if you have to figure that one out right then pq they've given me the, another key point that pq is the resultant of a b p b and pc in other words resultant means sum so pq is just equal to ap plus pb plus pc that's what the question is saying now i want to show that abqc is a parallelogram now that we want to show that um if it's a parallelogram we want to show that the opposite sides are equal right so you let's let's dive right into it all right so let's draw our triangle right so we have a b c right then p is a point so we just draw P, showing P on BC. Okay. Now, what do we have? We know that PQ is AP plus PB plus PC. Now we have to figure out where Q lies, right? And since we are trying to prove that AB, we want to prove that ABQC is a parallelogram. Now realize how this is how a parallelogram looks like, right? A program should look like something like this. So if it's a program A B Q C Q C that means Q must lie somewhere here. So you try you come back to your triangle to come and figure out where Q lies. So Q must lie somewhere here. So if Q lies here, that means you can join it, right? So you can join with some short dashes. Okay. Alright. So this now, now, now it looks like what a parallelogram. So Q is our point over here. Now, what do you want to prove? We want to prove that what the vector AB here is equal to CQ, and the vector AC is equal to what BQ, because we want to prove that something is what is a parallelogram. So we're going to use the identity they gave us, right? So we have PQ is equal to AP plus PB plus PC. So we will prove this one by one. So first, first let's prove that um let's prove that a b is equal to c q okay so now you realize that when i add a p plus p b i get a b straight away so i get a b here plus p c sorry a b all right so i get i've gotten my a b so it means i have to find out a way to find my c q so i will bring this over here so i now have p q minus what PC is equal to AB. Now, if you watch this carefully, you can see that PQ minus PC is actually CQ, right? And you let's prove it. Okay, so we we know what do we know? We know what do we know? We know that minus PC is equal to what? CP, right? We know this is true. So we just substitute minus PC with CP. So I have PQ plus what? CP. We call it a b now since vector addition is what is commutative i can change this over i can make it what this is the same as cp plus what pq and it's called what a b right so what is cp plus pq cp plus pq is just what it's just cq and it's, it should be called what a b so i have proven that what my cq is equal to what my a b that's my first that's my first part right now the second part is to prove that what is to prove that um ac is equal to what bq so we are going you use the same identity to prove to prove that what ac is equal to what bq so i'm going to leave that for you to do that okay so thank you very much